Hello and welcome to another What's Inside. Today we are looking at some Back to the Future cards. These packs went for 50 cents originally as you can see and each one has nine movie cards, one sticker and a stick of bubblegum. These were put out by Tops. I've got two packs here so let's see what is inside here. So we'll start with the first one. These are from 1989. The wax pack is held up pretty well, but they do open very, very easily. Alright. As with a lot of these kind of cards, they are half and half, so we will have the back of one of the cards with the gum stain. So let's start with that one first. That's card number 60. That's Biff is Scorned. And next we have card number 82. Followed by card, tw card 24. Which is Purchasing the Past. And card number 12. Check this place out. And we have the whole town has changed. Next stop, 1885. And Marty in disguise. Fifth mystery benefactor. And finally, here comes trouble. Number 19. Now it looks like I didn't get a sticker in this set, in this pack rather, so that's a little unusual. Oh yeah, this is the sticker here. No? Is it? No, it's not. It's card number 82. Yeah, no sticker. I feel a little cheated. Well, let's open our other pack and hope we have better luck with that one. First up, uh, this one didn't stain nearly as badly, which is good, but this side did with the gum. So we've got card number 16, makeshift escape. Then we have Biff hits the jackpot, number 53. Follow that DeLorean. Timely idea. Burning the Almanac. Man in the Shadows. It looks like this pack didn't have a sticker in it either. So I suspect some shenanigans are probably at play. Or these were just misprints. But it's a little unusual that no stickers were included. And very, very annoying. So unfortunately I won't be able to show you the stickers. 
but that happened occasionally with these type of cards with the wax packs sometimes they're tampered with if you get them second hand and sometimes they were just misprints where something did get collated correctly and you won't get a sticker but it's pretty uncommon to have two packs in a row like that so I wouldn't be surprised if somebody tampered with this because it's not that hard to reseal these but it's kind of annoying either way but that gives you kind of an idea of what the cards look like and the types of cards you might get inside the packs so they've held up pretty well pretty decent cardboard pretty standard for the time but that is what you might get inside of the back to the future 2 movie cards packs and these are fairly inexpensive these days so you can still find them for usually less than five dollars as of this recording in 2020 so if you're looking for these you can still find them and they do hold up pretty well unfortunately you will get the gum stained ones occasionally and that's disappointing but if you don't mind that it's not that big of a deal but that is what is inside I think they've held up pretty well so that's gonna do it for this one Sorry there weren't any stickers, I don't know what that's all about. It's probably just an error set from a box of them that was screwed up or something. But that's going to do it for this episode. Thank you so much for listening and supporting the channel. If you enjoyed the video, please hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss future reviews. If you want to help the channel in other ways, links are in the description and on the about page. And don't forget to check out my other channel if you're into comic books. It's Bad Comic Reviews. And in the meantime... We hope to see you on the next one.